On your 48 firewall, you can do many things using different methods. So if you want to block, for example, zip files or compressed files, you can move to security profiles, file filter, just name your profile, create new rule, and then choose the protocol and the file type, which could be bzip and other compressed files. But you can do that in another way. You can create a custom IPS signature that will block compressed files. So let's do that. All right, so let's move to security profiles, IPS signatures, create new signature, and let's name our signature block compress. All right, so we start with the FS bid. That's the header of every IPS signature. And let's name our signature. Let's name it block compress. All right, so we uh, end the keyword with um, semicolon and we move on to our second keyword, which is protocol. We uh, our IPS engine will look and examine the TCP protocol. So start up with double dash protocol TCP. Now the service again, let's end it with semicolon double dash. The service is HTTP, so let's just write that down. All right, another semicolon. And the flow, the direction is from server. We're blocking compressed files that come from different servers. So flow, and let's just add up the double dash from server semicolon and the file type is compressed so let's just add up the file type file underscore type and it is compressed so let's just write down compress and this file type will actually include different uh, compressed file types such as zip and so on so let's add it with semicolon and what else do we need we have the service we have the protocol we have the flow that actually comes from the server and we have the file type so yep we can uh, close our parenthesis and save our signature All right, so here we have it. We have it in the custom IPS signatures. So now we can create a security profile, add up that uh, block compress. So let's just um, do that. Intrusion prevention. Let's just name our sensor block compress. And let's look for that signature. And there we have it. Now, once we have it, you should set up the action. So let's just set it to block. Okay. Sorry for that. Haven't chosen that. Add selected. Okay. So here we have it. Block compressed. The action is set to block. And now we can edit up in our firewall policy.